2013, a man murdered Andrea Kruger in West Omaha. After her death, Kruger's mother cared for her grandchildren, and slowly the family started to heal. Then this past December, the family suffered a huge setback. Rebecca Ray is in the News Center with their story. Becky? Life is ever changing for the Krugers and the Roberts families. Just as they find a new normal, a medical mystery is leaving the family in turmoil. God doesn't give us much more than we can actually handle, and uh, we just sometimes we have to try to find the silver lining and look at everything as the glass is half full. Ryan Roberts is searching for that silver lining. Mid-December, his mother, Terry Roberts, went to the hospital with flu-like symptoms, unknowingly suffering a streptococcus bacteria, similar to a staph infection. Within 12 hours, Terry fell into a coma from toxic shock syndrome. And was non-responsive for 12 days. Faced with Terry's worsening conditions and a bleak outcome, Christmas Eve, the family decided to pull her off life support. They had said their goodbyes. She just magically woke up literally four hours before we moved her to, took her off of life support. So it's pretty incredible. It was the best Christmas present I could ever imagine. So she beat death. She doesn't want to be with Andrea yet, and she doesn't care if they cut off her arms and feet. Terry survived, and a new fight had just began. The toxic shock syndrome put such a shock on her body that her body naturally kind of sacrificed her limbs to to save her organs. And her hands and feet suffered gangrene. Doctors amputated all four limbs. You know, my mother having to learn to utilize four different prosthetics, you know, how to learn how to rewalk, how to redo virtually everything at 56 years old. Through it all, Terry still smiles and spends her day in therapy. So one day soon, she'll hold her grandchildren again. Nothing is impossible. I've if I've ever doubted myself in the past, I learned to just, I don't need to doubt myself. The family is now faced with medical bills and the task of remodeling Terry's home to make it handicap accessible.